Do you love science? Do you try to make things at home in your parents' garage? But when you went to turn your soldering iron, you were greeted by the likes of 10,000 bees! <laughs> what is happening? Is this video sponsored by Skillshare? They said we had to say it in the first 15 seconds. Well, good news, everyone. Put your goggles on because we've got life hacks. And uh, life hacks get dangerous. The video is titled Top 5 Awesome Life Hacks with Pencil. First life hack is a DIY soldering iron. All you need for this life hack is a pencil, pen, wire, a knife. Oh gosh, this is really getting dangerous. And uh, you just, you do this. That's anticlimactic. All of a sudden you just, you have this life hack done. First of all, it's dangerous. Second of all, it doesn't work. We don't even need to talk about the danger. We just talk about how this literally is going to be total doo-doo. Do we have anything we want to try and solder? Like I'm leaving, but that's just because. Bored already. If you want to try these life hacks yourself, make sure you're prepared. Five volts at almost two amps. Oh, it's getting hot. It's getting hot. I'm knocking things over. Can it melt chocolate? Is this gonna catch on fire? Oh, I can melt chocolate. So it's definitely hot. Will it solder? It's... Oh, that's very hot. So it's been going for like 30 seconds. It's saying the temperature is 25 degrees Celsius. Does not sound right, 26. Oh, it's melting, oh my God, wow. This is very hot, actually. Let's see, what can we solder? Do we have anything exciting to solder? How about some motors? Let's see if we can unsolder one of the leads. Oh no, see, now it's shorting. So, the spring is hitting the wire. God, look how corroded everything is. Hmm. In general, this life hack is pretty doo-doo. The spring naturally wants to slide down to touch the wire. Folds down into the wire, it slides down into the wire. Most of the time, you're gonna end up with the spring touching the wire, which means it's not putting current through the graphite, which means it's not heating up, which means it's shorting your power supply. Which is, is it dangerous? I don't know, but it's stupid. I kinda wanna see if this thing will catch on fire. Am I insane to think that if you live in a place where you have easy access to internet and free ample time to watch a video like this, you probably have the ability to go to the store and buy a soldering iron for what, $10, $15? You can probably buy one online directly from China for like, I bet you $5. Not only a soldering iron, but a soldering iron that works and doesn't burn your house down. It's on fire, ladies and gentlemen. Life hacks, I present to you the future <laughs> Science education. <laughs> I, like, it's almost like the accomplishments of mankind, like as great and amazing as they are, make this sort of stuff extra pathetic. Like, if this was some kid in high school trying to make a soldering iron, like that's amazing. But if it's some, some weirdo on the internet posting instructions, teaching kids how to make a thing that clearly doesn't work, like it doesn't even work in their video and the video is the opportune time to try and fake it working and they can barely, just barely fake it working. I don't know. There's like, one, it's dangerous. I, like who cares about that? Two, it's just disappointing. Like you're providing bad information to people. And that makes me sad. Leave a comment and uh, I'm gonna mail this to a winner because I don't want it. Oh, we could hook up to wall power and see what happens. This is gonna explode. Do we wanna do that? Um, ready? It's already exploded, that's it. Yeah. <laughs> but wait, there's more. It gets worse. A couple of the other ones were drawing on a piece of paper with a pencil and using that to conduct electricity, which honestly is pretty boring. So let's just move on to what I think might be the most exciting one here. <laughs> I really hope it's a tattoo guy. <laughs> it's starting to look like a tattoo guy. Okay, you glue a motor to a pen 
and there's like a needle sticking out. I, I cannot imagine this is anything other than a tattoo gun. This is a tattoo gun. This is a prison tattoo gun. So, top five awesome life hacks with pencil. A tattoo gun. <laughs> Am I insane? I'm not insane, right? Okay, first of all, <laughs> this is not a life hack. This is absolutely a prison hack. I would say we make a petition to force this channel to change the title of the video from life hacks to prison hacks. All in favor, say aye. Come on, John, raise your hand. Yeah. He's not gonna use it on himself, I hope. Actually, you know what? I hope he does. Did you see that cut? It plays like approaching the skin and then all of a sudden it's just ink covering his arm and he's not actually drawing on it. So, <laughs> we should make Michael use this. All right, we're gonna do it. Uh, we're gonna do it right. We're gonna do it wrong. The Washington Post sent an email saying they wanted to interview me about life hacks. <laughs> what? <laughs> I don't know what to say to them. All right, you gotta get your pen spring. Remember, top five awesome prison hacks with pencil. You're gonna need a pen spring. I don't think they give pens in prison. I don't know, if, I actually have never been to prison. Uh, if you've been to prison, leave a comment down below. I feel like I'm about to embed this wire into my finger. Got our wire somewhat straightened and now it violently pokes out the tip of the pencil. Uh, I've got this little motor that was stolen off a submarine that Peter Streeple built out of a toaster. I have a feeling that this isn't gonna work at all. Uh, and that, uh, that feeling comes from the fact that no life hacks work at all. We're gonna use a piece of spoon with a couple holes drilled in it. One mounts it to the motor, the other mounts it to the needle mabobber. I'm not a tattoo artist. I'm also not a regular artist. <laughs> this is so hard to make. All I want to do is just put the wire into the... <laughs> the curly cue of a wire has made this so much worse than it needs to be. Hey, look at a Tanacon badge. You know what? I don't really understand why we have a Tanacon badge. We, someone gave it to us at VidCon. All we gotta do now is melt another hole for the wire. And speaking of heat and melting, this whole city is on fire again. Not us, thankfully. Everyone's been sending tweets and, and messages asking if we're dead. It's basically a repeat of last year just in the city over, which is pretty terrifying. I feel weird talking about it. Like what kind of insight do you have to offer? Basically everything's on fire. And it's smoky and ashy and bad. Oh my god! Why is this so hard, Caraman John? No! I present our very own tattoo gun. I'm very excited about this. It's not a bad engraver. It's it's really stupid. I, I think anyone using this as a tattoo gun is out of their minds. It just sort of feels bad. <laughs> it doesn't really hurt. Turns out it doesn't pierce skin, which doesn't surprise me at all. So let's see if you can just draw on skin with it. Oh, this is not a good idea. <laughs> it doesn't look as bad as the video, but definitely not an actual tattoo. Not that I would know because I don't have any real tattoos, but uh, it sort of just smeared it on the surface. It just is like bouncing off your skin. Your skin indents, and then it doesn't have a lot of meat to push itself. This is dumb! Should we show Michael and see what he thinks? Are you asleep? Are you asleep? Oh, never mind. What time is it? What is it? You, you like literally cannot predict when he's going to be asleep and when he's gonna be awake. <laughs> We can't film with Michael because he's still asleep. Even though it's the next day, we sort of missed the small window where our sleep schedules and awake schedules lined up. Let's uh, thank the sponsor of today's video. They help us pay the bills so we can buy things like water and uh, 
vegetables. Let's thank today's sponsor, Skillshare, an online learning community where you can learn things from Arduino programming to freestyle rapping. Yo, it's William. William, yeah. talk about Skillshare. Skillshare. Skillshare, you can learn things like Arduino. Arduino. Skillshare, you can learn things like piano. Skillshare, you can learn things like making soup. Making soup. I don't know. Really good soup. It's really good soup. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Don't let my failures hold you back though. You too can start learning today at Skillshare.com slash the custom code in the description that we haven't picked yet. The first 500 people get two months free and after that it's $10 a month when you buy a whole year at once. Thank you Skillshare. And I'm sorry. The winners of the Cat 2 giveaway from last week are on the screen here. And also, there's like half the winners of the trading card games didn't respond. So if you didn't look, you probably won. Go look at that video and, and send a message because we haven't... Oh, you send an email. Uh, so go, go double check and make sure you didn't win because I think literally four out of 10 people have responded. So go check and send an email if you want. And thank you very much. We'll see you next time.